What's up guys? It's day five in the breeding project. So it's um, finally got some isolates starting on the Pleuratus dejamer. Right there is a good view. Um, so five days in, the oysters are starting to get some isolates, which is kind of what I expected. Um, I'll do a close up on these. You kind of want to be careful and in distinguishing the mycelium from potentially any fungi, especially penicillium is going to show up at this time too. Um, but you're going to look for any irregular growth, almost like a little piece of cotton or something. But um, I'm going to go ahead and label these as they appear. And hopefully we'll start seeing some chestnuts and piapino. So um, I, I have these uh, jar cultures that I made. Um, this is the chestnut um, from about six days ago and it's almost fully colonized so that's pretty exciting uh, I thought about another method that you can potentially isolate this mycelium is that if you wanted to you could pull one of these pieces and put it on a plate and that way you'd get some isolated mycelium that way um, once I saw some of the contamination in the Piapino I ran out of those fancy jars and I made this really simple, um, it's just a drinking glass with tin foil and it's the same exact method just to prove that you don't need any of this fancy stuff to s still get results. So this is Piapino backup number three and it seems to be colonizing nicely. So I'll keep you updated with those two, but I'll flip this camera around and label some of my isolates. Okay, so starting with this first plate, um, you can't really see it, but right in the top region right up here is going to be the first isolate, and that's on a 10 to the 4 dilution. So I'm going to be expecting maybe three or four more of these to be popping up in the next couple days. But you can see um, kind of the irregular formation it's very hard to see it on this camera. I don't know if it helps if you flip it around, but you'll start to see that develop more over the next couple days. But I'm just gonna go ahead and label this guy isolate one. And then if we come over here, there was a couple more that were starting up on the edge, I just gotta find them. So right up in here. Now these ones are a little bit more circular, so I'm kind of suspicious, but I'll just circle them and put day five possibly two, and I'll keep an eye on those. They could just be penicillium, but at least we have one isolate five days in. That's really fast, so that's good. All right, that was a quick update. I'll keep posting as more isolates start to develop. Much love.